My name is John Baldwin. I was born and raised in West Philadelphia, in the Winfield area, and I'm from this studio, honestly. I am a dancer, choreographer. Honestly, everybody that I encounter um, in terms of school and my family and church and my students around Philadelphia, they all inspire me and cultivate this, like, this persona for me. I actually try my best not to follow what's popular. Um, I go based off of my emotion, I go based off of my feeling, I go based off of what really sparks and ignites light inside of me. I tried to put labels on myself, but I am from West Philadelphia. Um, I feel like that's where the real work is at, that's where the real art is at. Um, that's what really separates what we make as artists from each other. You know, what are you doing? What are you focused on? What inspires you? What impacts you? What makes you feel a certain way about anything? So I really try to go after all the things that just make me smile on a daily basis. Um, and I try to take those things, <clears throat> even the things that make me upset, I take those things and I try to pour them, like pour it into what I'm making. So I feel like that is what sets me apart. And not only that, methodology of like approaching process like that but I feel like everybody does that at the end of the day but I am me so that's what sets me apart. My creative process is it looks like everything. Um, I'm a writer. Uh, I write in my notes on my phone a lot. I have over 50 journals that I have in my bedroom. Um, I love writing. I love researching. I love um, just taking little random things that I find or gifts that people give me and I'll keep them for years and I will build a process or a world based off of like these things. Just started at like midnight one night I believe I was in my bedroom just dancing under like a blue light and which I wanted to carry into the lighting for the actual piece you know blue light um, and also just like the cover art um, there's a guy that is the brown skin guy that is kind of like in a triangle position, which I really felt very strongly about like ending my solo in that same position to relate myself to his work. So again, like I said, you know, I really like to take the, the, the small details, the small things and carry them into everything that I do. Um, it's just how I felt that day. It's just, it's just how I felt that day. And that was a week ago, two weeks ago, I don't know. But, yeah. You can't heal my wounds When you're the reason I'm still blue And I'm still blind You can't be my northern star When you're the freezing home Seems so far You can't be my friend When all I want is you I think that it's really important for everybody that is at home watching this or that is wherever you are about your day watching this that you step into your light. Um, and I feel like stepping into the light is very figurative, it's a metaphor. Um, it can be whatever you want it to be, whether you are actually inside of the arts or you know, you're a doctor or you are you know, all of these other careers, step into your light and step into it into the way that you want to step into it. Um, and that's what's always going to set you apart from other people. That's what's always going to give you the energy to wake up every day and to be you, you know? Step into your light. That's what I want everybody to walk away with. Step into your light. Mm -hmm.